guys, what is going on? I hope you guys are having a great day. I know today is going to be a good day. Today I want to talk to you guys about being a college student and being a car enthusiast at the same time. I think it is one of the most difficult things to do, honestly. And uh, that being money, time, and the consumption of just all of those combined when you'd rather be spending that time working on your car, going to car meets and such. So one of the biggest things obviously with college is money. Money is pretty much everything in college besides your time. Each semester that I have been going to the current college that I'm at right now, my average tuition is around twenty-five to three thousand dollars per semester. Now, that being said, that's actually not that bad compared to other schools, but it still leaves you not that much room to work with considering you have to pay bills stuff like that and especially if you're paying college by yourself like I am really really hard to do that's kind of why with my car in my own life it's been like sort of slow with modding the car besides the fact that I really would want to have another car before taking this car apart because I need something else to get to work get to school so with having this as my only car, it's kind of hard to get back and forth from school or work if I have a project where this thing needs to sit or be taken apart and just don't have enough time to finish it all in one sitting. The roof on my car is covered in body filler and primer right now. And honestly, I don't want to be driving this right now outside when I could have had another car have it sit somewhere till it can dry fully and get back to work on it when I can come back. And this is only me speaking for myself. I don't know anybody else's situation. I know kind of Bry's on the same boat as me. He's got a lot of bills to pay for that. He's got to keep up on his stuff as well. So we're kind of in the same boat right now. But being the car enthusiast and trying to go to college is it's just a hard thing. Like You just got to face it. That's how it's going to be. And the way that I have tried to overcome that and just really get down and, and just grind every single day is to wake up early, go to sleep super late at night. Like I have been working super, super hard lately to keep up on bills as well as work as hard as I can on this car and making these videos on the channel. That being said, one of the biggest things that you guys can try and modify to make it work when you're in college and trying to get stuff done to your car is time management. Time management is literally everything. Like if you are bad at time management, just don't even bother. Every single morning I am up at 7 a.m. and I don't go to sleep until the next, technically the next day at 1 a.m. Wake up, go to school, go to my normal job, get out of the job, and go straight to work on the car. And it took me a little while to figure out a really good rhythm for myself because having no time, if people say they have no time, you do have time, it's just how you're managing it. And I had to realize to myself, what's up buddy? I had to realize to myself, what is more important to me? Do I want to go to school, then go to work, and then go home and like play video games or do some bull crap like that? Like, no, I don't have time for that. I don't want to be wasting my life playing video games or doing something like that. Like, obviously, yeah, it's fun with friends and stuff, but time management is what is going to get you from point A to point B with your car, school, whatever else you're doing. It really applies to anything. Second, let's talk about money. Money is one of the most important things when it comes to car modding, because it costs money to do anything and everything with your car. Technically, this is why my car has only, like the only thing I've done to it are the basics. So I have exhaust wheels, and right now I'm really, really focusing on the bodywork. For me, I could have bought the car as it was, start going heavy on the mods, but then I look at the car and I'm just like, this doesn't look right like I want to make it perfect I want to make it perfectly set up to then go ahead and modify the car not just throw a bunch of crap into it and have it just look like crap so I want to make everything really really structured and then build on from there honestly you can do whatever you want but that's just me I want to have everything perfect in the first place and not have to go back and redo things after I've already done them I don't have AC in my car so this is it's like an 80 degree day Always got the windows down anyway, so it doesn't matter. But. So if you guys are a student in college and a car enthusiast, I would love to hear your opinions down below in the comments section. Let me know how hard it is for you guys to be car enthusiasts in college, how you guys manage your time, just stuff like that. Thank you guys so much for watching this quick little video. I hope to see you guys in the next one. Please consider subscribing, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace out.
It's that wicked.